What we're going to go over now are some dynamic stretches that you can perform prior to a run. All of these are meant to be more of like a flow and kind of movement pattern. Um, you work within the range that you feel most comfortable doing um, and don't push past pain or your level of restriction. Okay? So we're going to start off with something called the Spider-Man. So you're going to go into a plank position. You're going to bring, we'll say your left leg up to left hand. You're then going to take left elbow and bring it down towards the inner aspect of your ankle and then reach up towards the ceiling. So it's not meant to be a long stretch. You're just coming down and reaching up. And then you can switch sides and then do the other side, elbow down, reaching up towards the ceiling. So you can do this about 10 times on each side, only holding for a few seconds. You can then go into a plank position again and then shift into a downward dog position. This can get into your calves and you'll feel a stretch back through there. You can do something called a walking dog where you bend one knee and bring the heel down on the opposite side and alternate back and forth. Again, this is meant to be a short duration stretch. You're not meant to hold this for a very long period of time. Another dynamic stretch is something called the inchworm. So again, going into that plank position, you can walk your feet up towards your hands, go until you feel a stretch, and then you can walk your hands away from your feet. You can also do the opposite direction where you bring your hands back towards your feet and then walk your feet away from your hands. 